Mr. Green, thanks for your time tonight. All right, thank you. Alvin Green, thank you. All right, thank you. And I might as well just get to some of these questions if you don't mind. What was your campaign like? Did you have a lot of campaign meetings? You didn't set up a website, right? No, no. I'm you didn't go door campaign. to door asking for people's help or... I mean, I understand he didn't hold any campaign functions. Did you have campaign rallies? Children's no. bake sales. You had no campaign signs. Did, did you go door to door to meet the voters? Or no. kiss any kids on the head? No campaign literature, no website. Or shake no. any grandparents, none of that, right? Yeah, I, I, well, I did just simple, old-fashioned campaigning. I just conducted a simple, old-fashioned campaign. What is old-fashioned campaigning? You know, all across the state of South Carolina. Can you tell me some of the towns that you visited, some of the people that you met with? Um, all, I'll just say that I've traveled all across the state. Congressman Clyburn suggested that you were planted in this campaign, possibly by Republicans. And a Republican plant, what do you make of that? Like I said before, I've always been a Democrat. No, I'm, I'm a Democrat. I've always been a Democrat. And, and I've always supported Democrats. And I still will be a Democrat in the future and support Democrats. You have a matter of a porn charge against you. Well, I have no comment on that. Are you, are you facing charges for that still? I have no comment about it. Nothing? But I have no comment. The, uh, the charge of felony obscenity last year, would you care to address that? I have no comment on that. No, no, seriously, sir, wait just a moment. Mr. Green, with great respect, you are running to be a senator from the state of South Carolina. I mean, you're not going to tell the people of your state the details of those charges? No, I have no comment on that. Do you think that when you're campaigning against Mr. DeMint, that at some point you're going to have to address that question? Yes. You, you know what people in your own party are saying, Mr. Green, is that yes. the reason people voted for you is, alphabetically speaking, you were first on the list. No, 60% is not luck. It was not luck. I, went, I had 60% of the vote. I had 60% of the vote. 60% of the vote is not luck. I got 60% of the vote, and 60% is not luck. 60% is very decisive. You're saying the same things over and over again in the yes. exact way you said them before. Are they written down? Have you... Okay. Well, I get asked the same questions all the time. Uh-huh. So I have the same answers for the same questions. Hmm. And to those who would say, I smell a rat, you would say, stop smelling? Yes. South Carolina's candidate from the Democratic Party to be a senator in the United States Senate. Thank you for your time tonight, Mr. Green. All right, thank you.